Hey friends, welcome to another video. All right, so I've collected a bunch of screenshots of different formations and stuff, and a lot of the top guys, and I'm gonna share them with you guys. So if you look at the top, you got King Bomb Bomb, Hypnos, Windsor, Stacy Lee, Celtic, Ezazim, Eris, uh, Russian Hippo, Abaz, a bunch of Braves for Robin, Chenty G, Longbow. So these are pretty common names at the top. There's usually the same um, 20, 30 guys that, and, uh, that are up there. So I'm just going to show you some of their lineups because I've, I've been at the top. I'm at 107 right now just because I'm being stupid because of this. Just basically I pushed Hypnos past uh, Stacy Lee single-handedly. So I beat Stacy Lee, but I couldn't beat Hypnos. And it was funny because Hypnos was behind Stacy Lee. And then, uh, sorry, Stacy Lee, but I put Hypnos up in the second there behind uh, King Bomb Bomb there with my bunch of wins for him. Anyway, so I'm just going to go through some screenshots and give you guys, kind of show you guys what the top dudes are using um, in the game. So there's going to be a mishmash of mishmash of um, heroes mostly alley but you got some chions arthurs selene's zeus's davison's so um i'm just gonna go to my screenshots here currently here's the number one guy king bomb bomb uh, that's what he had going on there really um so there's that kind of weird formation um, I'm just going to go to the front here and kind of cycle back through if I can. Sorry about this here. So, and all right, so here we go. Start with Stacy Lee. There's her formation. Um, get you guys kind of an idea. And a lot of people like copy what she does. Um, I, my own is kind of formed off of what she did, kind of a template, but I do have, I like the three pirate ships. Um, so there's Stacy Lee. Hypnos, this is the guy for some reason um, couldn't beat. He's similar to mine and Stacy Lee's lineup there. Uh, he's got the single undead in the back. I got two. I think Stacy Lee has three. I got two. I got four up front. So, all right, here's Amusement. Here's an Arthur. Um, I play. I beat. I fought this guy twice. Once he beat me by a bunch and the next one I steamrolled them by like 150 so that's with Arthur and I guess with Allie you never know what it's going to be so it's kind of a toss up sometimes alright here's Celtic another um, top um, player here I fought him twice beat him once and lost once so that's I'll take that you know um, alright moving on here's ALN Slayer you guys kind of get the picture of what mostly people use with Alley. You got your voodoo dolls. Uh, the standard is four, usually. Um, witchcraft totems. You got your stone golem up front and undead and uh, peltas and stuff like that. So pretty common. Here is Texas size ten four, also known as Dave is always here. Hey buddy, shout out. And so he's got a ton of undead in there. Two, four, six, eight, ten undead. They can do, they can take a lot of damage. All right, moving on. We have this guy. He's been in the top here and there. Here's a, here's a Selene right here. This one beat my alley formation. And then I copied it and tried to beat my alley formation, and it didn't go anywhere. So there's a pretty good Selene formation there. Okay, moving on. I remember you. This guy um, beat me. Yeah. So just little variations here and there. You can kind of tweak your formations. Look what the top guys are using. Here's Starchy. And kind of, you can kind of mess with your formations and stuff and train against it. Unfortunately, a lot of the training stuff, it's, it seems to go with the defensive guy has the advantage but I don't know maybe I'm off on that here's a uh, Arthur formation 
Sorry about there is my uh, spider lady formation. Here's uh, Celtic again. Here is WMBX uh, top ranked uh, Celine. Funny when I copied that formation and tried it against mine, I got wrecked. My alley wrecked this Celine, but when I fought him, he beat me a couple times. Pretty sad. All right. Um, here is King Bomb Bomb again. Pointy tactic. He's been top in the top ten a lot of times. Here is Lord Jammin. I believe he's top uh, at least top ten, top fifteen right now. So you kind of see in the pattern here. This is a similar Meliora, another top ranked alley. Pretty much everyone's using Alley or Arthur right now for defense. You got Dylan here. Very interesting to see the double um, stone golems up front like that. And for coming up against a formation like that, you're like unsure. It's like, man, I don't know. You don't want to risk it maybe, but whatever. So Brave Sir Robin, another top alley player, going with the eight um, magic apprentices up front. And uh, kind of a little, it's not, you get the three uh, witchcraft totems. So a little bit irregular. Brave Sir Robin again, here's Gucci. Uh, going with the Arthur formation, usually rocking and alley. Here's Rip, Lady of Chaos, ton of Peltas. Generally doesn't work too well, I don't think, with uh, going up against alley. They seem to all cluster in on that one um, stone golem and then get nuked. But if you can prevent that from happening, it's a it's a good deal. I mean, if you can keep your your Peltas from just coming into a little ball for Ali to nuke, then it says it works out pretty good, but um, I think I won that fight. All right, here is another Selene, Shark Diver, been a top uh, player. Lots of, uh, you know, some Priest Mages, lots of um, Ballistas. I think I also copied this one, didn't work for me. Um, here's this guy. I like the three pirate ships. Been working pretty well for me. Um, been messing with Japan Shiro. This guy this was a tough one to beat. Um, here's Eternal Brain. So you guys just kind of give me guys idea. These guys are all top, top 100 players here. Uh, Chopper, another good Arthur formation. Digger, just a ton of Peltas. Um, who the heck is this? Oh, that's my my formation. I was trying to see on the yacht on there. Okay, sorry about that. All right, here's Ellie, another Celine. Kind of see how, what the main deal with the Celines are. Usually, it's the two um, witchcraft totems up front. You got some uh, pelts around it, and then your rear. It's pretty pretty similar there. El Matador, another Celine. Jen Osman Ghazi. Okay, pretty standard. You got the eight up front magic apprentices, kind of build around that. And Crossfire. I can't remember if this guy beat me or not. Sometimes you see those unorthodox ones here, like, what the heck? All right, here's Stacy Lee again. Uh, so you can see from this one to the last one, I think she. Tweaked it a little bit, put a uh, undead soldier in the back, and obviously look at my lineup is different also. So everyone's constantly kind of tweaking their lineups. Here's an Arthur Foundation fa uh, formation. I was going up against Tabula Vita Rasa. Okay, Sir Fuse a lot. Um, higher using, pretty high ranking guy using a uh, Zeus. This is the first time I encountered this um, Rhino Stone Golem up front combo, and actually I lost this one. So here's uh, Eric Hard rocking a um, Davison. Here's Escort Celine offense here. Here's an Arthur. Painkiller, USA Painkiller, Kira, 
Uh, what else we got here? That is not Wawatek. Here's Johnny. ALN by Syrian Bro. Rooster ALN. Typhoon. Seems like the Priest Mages and the Ballistas are the main thing in that. Typhoon's been rocking the Selene for a long time. I, for, for whatever reason, whenever I use Selene, it like never works for me. But whenever I attack the Selene, I always get killed. I'm like, what the heck? Arthur. Ar Arcelius or whatever. Here's Hobbs, another top ranked. Um, Allie rocking the uh, split uh, stone golems with the three ships up front. IV Harmless Bunny, another top ranked one. Slick Ninja. Here's Stacy Lee. Obviously, you can see a little bit different formation here that she's gone with. Um, the uh, Ghost Assassins have changed positions in the last one. Here's Longbow. Rocking the. Uh, Three um, Goblet Kazis up front. Chinti G. Here's Celtic again. See Yak Attack. Alright, so there's just a whole bunch of them. These are mostly the top guys. And I thought I'd give you guys here's Kronos. Give you guys a rundown here. Um, show you what people are using. Here's amusement. Everyone's they change their formations all the time to try to counter what's being countered and recounter or whatever. So it's just a constantly evolving. But the one thing that's pretty much been the constant right now lately, no one can seem to figure out how to beat this single stone golem up front. It seems like everybody's using that. That's the go-to thing. So here's a Siandiak with no ballistas. Interesting. All right, guys, so that's it for this video. I mean, if you want to pause, uh, check out people's formations, um, download them or whatever, or make them your own, that's what I'm here for. You can check out what the top guys are using. And uh, thanks for watching this one. We'll catch you next time.